Greetings all, it's the Devious Monkey here. All right, back in the studio now. I've been on the road all week, went to visit my mother-in-law, finally got back, was ready to go out and play today and hit Pleasure House Point and do some birding or at least just some walking around since I've spent so much time sitting or being in my car sitting that, uh, yeah, I was looking forward to it. Torrential downpour and thunderstorms pretty much all day through the night. So that's out. So I had to come up with something that I wanted to do because I did film a lot throughout the week while I was gone. And I know that I'm my own worst critic, but I have to say that it's pretty unwatchable. Uh, I did an entire video sitting on my mother-in-law's porch and the focus breathing from the 20 millimeter on the A7C with like the, the white picket type railings in the background and the framing was unwatchable. I watched like 10 seconds of that footage and was like, oh no, can't put that out there, not doing that. That's not the purpose of this video. The purpose of this video is this right here, the Acasis USB-C hub that I got for the iPad Pro 2021 M1, 12.9 version. And that's so that I could be more productive on the road. You know how I've said that, oh, I don't wanna go on the road cause I gotta bring all this shit with me and this, that, and the other thing. And this is what it gets down to. Normally, if I wanted to shoot video while I'm on the road and post every night with an iPad that is. So I would have to have all this gear with me so that I could take the footage off of whichever camera, whether it be through the SD card or getting it to here so that I could take the information from the camera, get it on the hard drive, get it to the iPad or get it off of here to get it on the iPad, then get it off the iPad onto one of these things so that I wasn't gunking up my iPad with a bunch of shit. Now, with this Acasis thing, watch what goes away. Now, just with these cables, if I need it. This is an HDMI cable. This has a micro SD card reader, SD card reader. It has USB-C, two USB-A, three, what? A 3.0 and a 3.1 in addition to an ethernet cable, in addition to the HDMI right there. What else can this thing do besides just use one freaking cable to hook right into the iPad? Well, watch this. Now on the inside, and I just put the heatsink tape on there, I have a one terabyte SSD chip in there. So not only is this a hub, it is also a one terabyte drive. Now that means that I can take this and that's it. I'm done. I don't need any other cable. I don't need any other device. If I also wanted to put this into the mix, I would just have to connect this to this and I can transfer everything to and from if I needed to. But I don't really need to do that while I'm on the road because this has one terabyte. So any footage that I shoot, you know, the couple of days I'm on the road can all just, I could just stick the card in right there, read it and edit right on the iPad. And then if I want, I can take everything off the iPad, put it into the drive on this. And then when I get home, I can take everything off this and put it onto another device. You have no idea how much time and effort that saves me because I can get that hub and every cable into this little container. And that's it. Throw that in my backpack along with my iPad and I'm good to go. Doesn't matter which camera I have. Now, of course I said that if I shot with my iPhone, I can automatically get it into LumaFusion and just have it on the iPad. And then if I want, I can take everything off the iPad and put it onto this or wait until I get home and do it because I'm not gonna shoot that much stuff that I'm gonna run out of room on a one terabyte drive. The other thing is that once iOS 15 comes out, and now that LumaFusion 3 has come out, I can actually edit straight off of this drive. I don't have to take the info or the files or any of that shit from this drive to get them onto the iPad. Now, things like my intro, and I still have to figure out how to do my subscribe and, and any other thing that I put in there, because I still suck at LumaFusion, but anything that I take I can have on the drive or leave it in the LumaFusion folder on the iPad. It's not taking up that much space. And I then can put other things on this drive now that I have it all set up. 
I can drag and drop a shit ton of extra pictures that I might use or any of the epidemic sound stuff or if I download from Storyblocks, I can put that on the drive as well. So in the end, everything is like just it works massively that much better now that I have this hub that I was waiting for. I can't recommend it enough. The thing about this Acasis drive and being able to put in and you know like a, an SSD chip is that it takes several different sizes, several different types, anywhere from like a 500 gig all the way up to an eight terabyte chip, which I wasn't going to invest in because that's insane. It's like crazy expensive. So I got a one gig chip. It was like 120 bucks and they recommend Sabrent and that's what's in there. It's a Sabrent NVMe. Uh, M1 or 2 or 3 or whatever the hell thing. You know, there's so many numbers and letters after that I don't know, but I'll link it, of course, in the description. But the bottom line is, is that this thing is like unbelievable. And that's what I wanted to talk about today. I just wanted to show you this thing. As I said, that once I got it and got everything set up and ready to go, I would, I would do a video on it. It is a game changer. I know that's such an overused term and it's so annoying, but it really is. Do yourself a favor, look them up online. I'll have it linked down below. You might want to give it a consideration. Uh, it gets a monkey seal of approval. If you have anything you want to ask, I mean, I can't give you too many technical specs. You can go to the site and read about it yourself, but it plugs in, it works. There, it's, it's dumb monkey proof, theoretically. So that's it, that's all I got for you. As always, thank you for joining me. Be sure to like and subscribe. And remember kids, forward and up.